settings menu. Traditional controls, motion controls. Mm, yeah, I moved the thing a lot. It was a dark and stormy night. Shit. That was sudden. Hey. I'm gonna stream until dawn. Until everybody dies, I guess. Probably. Yeah. I'll see. Uh, let's turn subtitles on because, of course, let's turn subtitles on. Enable PlayStation camera. Enables the cheap shots feature, which will automatically record video as you play. I can I do that while I'm streaming? I'm about to see. Sidebar text. Enable or disable overlay text for written material. Um, okay. Reading is fun. Can all this other stuff's good. That white girl crying. Camera captures. View recordings captured during your story. Okay. Alright. So, they know the parts to actually clip for me. Oh, and there's like... Okay, collectibles. There's collectibles. I thought this was straight up like an FMV game, but it really is like a David Cage thing. The butterfly effect. The tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane tomorrow? I missed part of it. Oh, I should die in. The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Oh, fuck. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. See, I'm already, like, moving in my chair. The motion controls are not gonna cut it. Okay, yeah, vein on the butterfly wings. Your story is one of many possibilities. Choose your actions carefully. We're just starting right away, huh? Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh. Don't you guys think this is a little bit wrong? Oh, come on, she deserves it. And it's not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em. I'm not anybody's man. Whatever you say, darling. Alright, they're already annoying me a little bit. Great for slasher films. This is just cruel. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Oh, I'm not gonna like this. Oh, it looked like the knife was through his head. Hey, did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh? Okay, now I can look around. There's something over there. 
What was that? That was a dot. I saw a dot. Press and hold R2 to pick up the note. Use the right stick to turn around. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m., Mike. Oh, my God. Oh, that's what, what the I sidebar... Oh, okay. I didn't even read that. I just read it off the page, but I should have... Okay, Beth is pretty hot. Use the right stick to look around. Objects that glint can be inspected. Okay. Wait, that wasn't glinting, but it wanted me to... Now it's glinting. Press and hold R2 to pick up the bottle. Okay, this is come. Press and hold... Hold R2 and use the right stick to inspect objects. Jeremiah Craig. Okay. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Mm. I got your note. Glad you could make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know making out and see where it goes from there. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt? This what are you is... doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. It's all gonna happen. Just but... a stupid prank. Uh, oh, hey. You guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! They sure are. Use the right stick to choose. Josh! Josh! Fuck. Dude, you gotta get out of there. Alright, asshole. Guys, there's someone outside. What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. Mm. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Hey, <laughs> you Press the correct action button before the timer runs out. This is already really stressful. <laughs> Were those the footprints? This music building up. Mm -hmm. Use the touchpad as shown. This is dickish. Hannah. Oh, she did it to light her phone. Okay. This is walking faster? Jeez. Hello? Hello? What the f- 
R1 Death Totem. Totem prophecies Black Death, the possible death of the person who finds it. Indigenous tribes believe that butterflies brought dreams and premonitions. Each totem piece foretells a future, a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. As you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear. Black is death. Guidance is yellow. Loss, danger, fortune. Okay. Um, that's... Oh shit. What the hell was that? That looked like a thing to press, but. Anna. Anna. Oh shit, huh? Hannah. Is that a cliff? Anna. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. <laughs> Anna, uh oh, there goes the light. Oh, the analyst. That sucks. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. <sighs> but there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. Was that unavoidable? I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every well, single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. Back off, man. So, you mad close. You have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. This is some persona ass bullshit. Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side. His facial Find expressions are just. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this. Experience. I feel like some of them are going slower than they should, but... That yeah, was pressing R2. Oh, that's creepy. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. 
okay. Honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Your eyes? The... I'm not sure, honestly, for that picture. If it is something you can't see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? I mean, is there something in the house? Is there something under the scarecrow? So, if it's not in the house, then where do you think it is? It's in the field. Wow. See, and is this threat human or is there some other fear that you had that you would like to talk to me about? So you think there's a person in this field that is a threat to you? That's quite intriguing. Oh well, perhaps what is with the mouth stuff? Further in our next session, I'm afraid. We've run out of time. Has it really only been 15 minutes? Jeez, this feels like forever. Okay, so you just build my provider then? Sony Computer Entertainment. I hid my water. Until dawn. Super massive game. Super massive is the company, right? They did a couple others like this. Tonight, the Washington Messing. girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Okay. Oh, that was who was right. passed out. Well, it's Mr. Hello, Robot. friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but I just want you all to know. Was Christian Slater um, Mr. Robot? I mean, only saw the first season. 
I thought Christian so Slater was in his head. That we're doing this, and uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all still here together. Why? Why would you I'm do this? Why that. would you go back? I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one. He's of gonna you kill all of you. Just share some moments that I would kill all we'll of never you. Never forget, for for the sake of my sisters, and you know. Okay, so. Let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? All yes! Right. <laughs> Everybody deserves to die. I'm gonna go back. I'd send my condolences and just... Great comic books or some shit. in jail. All these motherfuckers were like party to this girl's death. And her sister. Until dawn. Hello, Sydney. What's your favorite scary movie? Diligent, considerate, adventurous. Sam, Hannah's best friend. Also, Kyrie in Kingdom Hearts. Sora? Oh, I'm trying. It's not really moving the camera, it's like moving her more than the camera, but... Sure. You'd think so, but I couldn't inspect that flower. I kept trying. Wow, what? The gate's busted. Climb over. What was that? From Josh Washington. Vancouver Central. It's terminus. Then... Yo, how do I get there again? Okay, this is... Is that bullshit? Okay, I can climb over here. Let's do quick. I was just curious to see what the start button did. Aww. When a don't move yeah, icon is on that. screen, keep the wireless okay. controller as still as possible. Huh? <laughs> okay. We're unsure what to do next. You can see your current objective by pressing R1. Head to the cable car station. Oh, there's a lot of stats. She is not funny, is she? Or romantic. 
but she's brave and charitable. How brave, they say about her. How brave. Your best friend died and you go back to the place she died. Because you couldn't keep your asshole friends in line. <laughs> cool. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Okay, this is the thing from before. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believed that butterflies carried their dreams and prophecies of possible features. Color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Uh -huh. As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. Picking a totem and turning it will reveal a colored butterfly and a premonition of a possible future. I keep pressing R2 too early for this shit. Black Death. What? How was that Death? Or was that Gu- oh, that was Guidance. It's walking toward a bird. future is uncertain. Whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make. Press R1 at any time to view your totem collection. Again. Because I already pressed it. That's the cable car station, right? Oh, what's that backpack? Chris? You here? The bag's here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Oh shit, what's that? Aha! Look who it Butterfly is. Butterfly effect appears in here. <coughs> She's a narrative again. 